Default, when you open the Metamax um, app, you see that you have this Ethereum main network, which means that the token or the address you are generated um, that is generated for you is an ECR base. Can you see? This is the Ethereum, this is the Polygon network. So that means that the one that is actually generated for you is the Ethereum based network, which is the one we called ECR20. Then the question is, what is an ECR20 um, wallet address? Is, is, is a kind of unique alphanumeric alpha string that is usually 42 characters long which identify your ERC20 wallet okay you know Pixel, Pixelverse for example stated that for you to claim your PiFi um, tokens you need to connect an ERC20 um, which is um, from Metamax they specify that Metamax and pref prefer then if you are going to come um, con if you are going to connect to this particular wallet, all you just have to do is on this tab here where I have this, I will just click on this copy button. Then when I click on this copy button, then I go to the area where I need to claim my um, my tokens and I paste it there, then I'll be able to claim my rewards. So an ECR20 um, wallet is a wallet that allows um, others to send you an ECR token. It has to be an ECR token. They cannot send you a TRC token to an ECR token. There, there are some strategy or some mechanism that will actually dictate that you are sending an incompatible wallet address. So it has to be on an ERC um, network and an ERC related tokens. Because once you receive these tokens, it adds to your Ethereum blockchain. All right now, so let's head up to um, Pixelverse and see how we can claim our tokens. We are on the Pixelverse um, dashboard, that is the Telegram bot. So now I will head up here and click on claim. So you can see that you have been assigned a particular NFT avatar. Then I'll click on next step. Then I'll click, you can see I have 230 um, PixFi um, token. So I'll click on claim PixFi. Then you can see it stated here that you can only ent enter non-custodian wallets. All exchanges that, has, that are not supported with this with the wallet you have connected. If you are connecting the wrong wallet, you are going to lose the wallet. You can see it will be born irrevocably. You cannot recover the, the um, token again. So here I'm going to paste what I have copied from, uh, what's it called, from Metamax. I'll just click here and click on paste. And I'll just click on yes, I use non-custodian wallet. Then I'll click on claim. Please be very careful. Make sure that you have con um, copied the right wallet address from Metamax, just like I have showed in the earlier part of this video. So click on claim PixFi. And you can see it says, congrats, your PixFi are in dashboard. Connect this wallet to your dashboard for coins are displayed in the staking section. So you have to go to staking. You have to open it through your browser. So we have this loading. Okay, so I'm going to connect um, MetaMask. But I need to warn you that if you decide to use your Chrome browser, you have lots of errors or issues connecting to the MetaMask, um, what's it called, app. So I would advise that you take the other approach, which, um, which will be displayed in the next slide of this video. It will make your connection very easier for you. So then another thing you need to do is to add up to the uh, MetaMask uh, dashboard. Under settings, make sure that you disable the authentication for login. Yeah. Uh, to temporarily de um, deactivate that so that it can be easy for you to connect and after you've, you have successfully connect the wallet you can activate it back okay so this is what i will do i will just come back here and copy this address yeah. head back to metaverse and so head back to metaverse use the browser section then enter that address there i think that will save us lots of time let's just try that So now, since we are not prompt, um, prompted with um, the connect, um, since we did not receive the connect prompt, so I'll just add to the um, browser tab here. Which is the fourth option on the bottom menu then i'll use the search future and i'll just paste the address that we have copied then i'll click on go so this is asking us to connect our meta wallet 
so we just click on connect if you look at this this is very easy for us to connect unlike the web method that i've been using and if you look at i have i have to click on sign to authenticate this and now you can see that i have my drop ticket of 1.5 and this is 2.3 and i have 2.2 million pix file that this is um the yeah, yeah. okay i'll explain why we have this under the economic and uh, community incentive and um, incentives pool i'll explain why you have why you have this it is possible that your balance will come here and you and you'll be able to claim it under the stake tokens for example if you look at under my stake tokens i have 230 pix file which i have staked this balance already because they made it clear in their videos that in their sorry in the announcement that the amount once withdrawn will be taken to stake pool so immediately it will be staked